Peace and blessings. I am Michael Bernard Beckwith, the founder and spiritual director of the Agape International Spiritual Center. I also have the privilege of being a co-founder and now president of the Association for Global New Thought. We're entering into a very powerful time right now. It is our season for interfaith, intercultural celebration, in which we're joining with hundreds of different task force and individuals around the world to really celebrate the interfaith and intercultural aspect of living. We'll be joining with task forces around the world, celebrating our rich diversity and celebrating our deep peacemaking and peacekeeping efforts, of which we're also deeply involved and hold a prayerful space around. October 24th is also a very special day. We'll be working with Humanities Team, of which Neil Donald Walsh is the, the spearhead of this, and collecting signatures to present to the United Nations to create a day in which we will be celebrating our oneness on an annual basis. We want you to get involved with this. We want you to hold the space with your vision time, your prayer time, and we want your physical efforts in terms of not only signing, but getting people to, to get signatures so that we can really create a space around this. We really want to create a wonderful energy where people are seeing and feeling and articulating what it's like to feel that we're all one. These are powerful times in which we're living and we get to participate in the evolution of our species through our thought, our word, and our action. Please join us. Hi, I'm Neil Donald Walsh with Humanities Team, here to share a few words with you about Global Oneness Day on October the 24th. And I'd like to begin by saying thanks to the worldwide church community for focusing on Global Oneness Day in your sermons on Sunday the 24th of October. That's going to be very important to you, to us, and to members of your congregation, I know. Humanities Team also welcomes the opportunity to partner with the Association for Global New Thought during this season of interfaith, intercultural celebration. Global Oneness Day, as you may know, was created to celebrate our oneness with God, with humanity, and with all of life on one day, so that in the not too distant future, we may celebrate our oneness every day. It's kind of like Earth Day. Recall how Earth Day began as a single day celebration. And then soon people all over the world were making every day Earth Day. That's our intention here with Global Oneness Day. Global Oneness Day is important because it focuses on seeing the divinity in all of us, in every single human being. When we see the divinity in all of life, we serve all of life. That is why Ambassador Chowdhury of the United Nations said that solidarity meaning unity and oneness, go hand in hand with peace, security, and a compassionate and sustainable world. In a sense, oneness turns the key and opens the door to the future, a future we all want for ourselves and for our children. When we see that we are all one, we serve life first. This is our future. This is our destiny. And the time to live that destiny is right now. In oneness, we invite you to do many things with us on Global Oneness Day. You could begin by signing our Global Oneness petition, declaring our unity with all of humanity. There's a link to that petition on both the websites of the AGNT, the Association for Global New Thought, as well as Humanities Team. You could also go to a senior citizen home or to a homeless shelter or to a center for domestic abuse or to a school in your community. There are many places that you could offer your service, even, even go to a next door neighbor who may need some help cutting the lawn or getting some other household chore done. And in becoming involved in that unique and extraordinary way, you become one again with all those whose lives you touch. In fact, you could go anywhere in your community where there is a need, but do it in oneness where you see God and see yourself in the other. Then the magic that you feel and receive is experienced at the same time. Then you become a living, breathing demonstration of oneness. And you can feel that moving through your body as you are sharing with another from that unique and wonderful place. You know, if the whole world did this for one day, the whole world would change in one day. And if the whole world did this every day, the whole world would change forever. I can't tell you how happy I am to see this wonderful partnership between Humanities Team and the Association for Global New Thought surrounding this whole idea of oneness and oneness day on the 24th of October. It's a perfect example 
of how two organizations can join together in a demonstration of oneness, coming together and working together toward a common goal. Thank you to all of you who are part of the Association for Global New Thought for this fruitful partnership. Without you, we couldn't have done this. With you, we're on our way to creating a new world, a brand new experience of life for you, for me, and for all of us. So from Humanities Team and the Association for Global New Thought to all the rest of you who are watching this, thanks for joining us. Thanks for climbing aboard. Thanks for becoming part of the creative partnership that can shift the world's experience of itself.